Hey, good Saturday afternoon, Internet. Mike here again to talk about getting into your R data once again. Um, today I'm going to talk about comparing R to uh, Microsoft Excel pivot tables and how you're going to use R to simulate what you're doing through tables and pivot tables in Excel. Um, the easiest way that I've found so far to do this is with the dply r package and the dply r package has a variety of different filters um, so you can filter which is going to select a bunch of data and put it into your data frame for r you can also group by so it's going to take a field and put everything together so if you have years put all 2005 2006 2007 2008 all together in each year category uh, and then you can select a group of data and manipulate that. You can use that by the summarize function. And the summarize function is actually going to move your data around like you would in a pivot table. So you're going to take um, uh, what you want to summarize, the column that you want to summarize, and you're going to give it some function, and you're going to get some data that comes out of that. And so this is going to give you a lot more control over your um, R data frames. And it's also going to help you move data around once you have it in a good condensed you know, CSV file or any sort of data set that you can manipulate because you won't be able or you will be able to get all your information together in one place and then move it on around however you want so you can then do whatever you want with the data.